back to the vlog. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you guys all had a swell weekend. I know I had a lot of fun. Uh, I was quite busy, but hey man, that's just sometimes just how it goes. Unfortunately, I couldn't get my wheels done again. At this point, I just feel like we're gonna keep the dirt tires on forever and just make the best of it. I mean, at least it's kind of like a dual sport, at, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we'll do some uh, off-roading adventures in the near future. I mean, we're technically a dual, sp dual sport for now. Besides all that, I hope you guys had fun. I hope you guys did plenty of things or at least relax a little bit. Unfortunately, I didn't film this weekend because I was just kind of busy. I did, however, try to film. I went to K1 Speed Zone with my family and I guess K1 Speed Zone doesn't allow filming anymore which I was very surprised about. I ended up having the GoPro on the front of my helmet and they told me to take it off and I wasn't allowed to do that uh, while being on the track, I guess. Um, I'm not too sure what that's about, but that was kind of a bummer because I really did want to film uh, racing a K1 because I was on a hot streak. I ended up putting fast slap in um, and it was a blast. This car's got a lot faster since last time I went. I feel like they got faster. It could just be me. Um, oh. In other news, we did get a new visor for my Bell helmet, which I'm actually really excited about. I ended up getting um, the Bell Iridium, a silver Iridium visor. I believe silver or gold. I might have got gold. But yeah, I wanted a reflective lens just because, in my opinion, they look better. I have the, um, the auto tint visor that came with the Bell, which is fantastic. I have no issues with it. The only thing is... I just like when people really can't see my eyes. So like when it's sunny, the helmet looks really cool because it's super dark, the visor. And then, you know, it gets clear when there's no sun. And I just don't like the look of the helmet that way. I'm sure a lot of you guys can agree. I know a lot of people have reflective visors just because, and I mean, sim simply they are, they just look cooler. So that's what we ended up doing. So uh, when I get home, I'll go ahead and put that on. I'm actually super stoked on that. And besides that, we've already completed work. We already hit the gym. So we're on our way to go get some food because I did not have time to go to the grocery store this weekend. So I did not meal prep. So we're gonna go get some pokey. And I mean, I, I'm i gonna have a really good dinner because I love pokey. And it gives me a great excuse to go get it without feeling bad about the fact that I'm wasting money because I have food at home. So I'm gonna take advantage of it all I can. the uphill all right There's a pokey spot right here too that's actually really good but i'm gonna opt for going to the one across the street from where i live because they have spicy tuna on crispy rice and i forgot how good that snack is and i had it this weekend at a sports bar and you know what that's what i'm craving so that's what we're gonna go get we're gonna get a bowl and we're gonna get some uh spicy tuna on crispy rice or else i would go to the one right here because their their food's actually really good i just don't think they have uh, spicy tuna on crispy rice but Hello, sir. Oh, Chipotle. I still haven't tried their new steak. Heard it's really good, though. The ass. Sir, where is your helmet? Please put your helmet on. You are playing with fire. Here.
actually no traffic today. I'm surprised. Oh, I mean, there's some traffic up there, which I'll probably run into, but very close to home, so it does not really matter. Man, there's so many good places to eat that I'm passing, but we gotta stay healthy. We gotta eat good. We gotta eat good during the week so we can eat like crap on the weekends. Well, not crap, but like you can splurge a little and not really care, you know? That's kind of my motto. It's like, I'm like, cool, I can eat chicken throughout the week, and on the weekends, I'll go get myself In N Out or pizza or whatever it is. It usually balances itself out. go to the gym during the week, take the weekend off, and enjoy the weekend. Ah, the anticipation killer. Oh, that man is picking his nose. Was that first gen, second gen? Or was that second gen? Super clean. Looked really bouncy though. I don't know if you guys can see that on camera. The thing was bouncing hard. Super clean though. I would definitely get a second gen R8. So, so clean. And they're like not too much. I guess in the supercar world, like. They're kind of affordable. I mean, they're still out there, but like kind of affordable in the supercar world. And to be honest, I don't know. I like the second gen a lot. I know there's a lot of people that say the first gen's better. I mean, the first gen's what got me into Audi R8 for sure, especially because of Iron Man. But I'll say the second gen is definitely cleaner, especially when it's lowered on some wheels. Oof. Super fresh. Oh, hello, sir. Mm -hmm. I feel like these lights in Irvine, they can take so long. Like, ridiculously long. You're just chilling there. It doesn't help that <laughs> on the Grom, I feel like the centers don't, don't feel it. And I don't know why, but I feel like a lot of people here, like, don't pull up to the actual line at the light. So the sensors aren't picking up anything. So I feel like the lights just take extra long. I'm telling you, it's like an Irvine thing. No one wants to pull up to the line. I don't get it. I don't get it. it smells like a fire. It definitely smells like a fire. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Four, 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 four. If you guys need a taxi cab in Irvine, apparently that's the number to call. Get your taxi cab now. Hmm. And that I've never seen a trail boss in that color. I wonder if that's wrapped. So I like the, I like it. It's like a nice brown tan color.
There's a Dave's Hot Chicken right here. And please let me know, but I tried this on, a, not opening day, but like opening week. And I I thought it was way overhyped. I, I've seen people that say it's really good, this and that. I don't know. I thought it was I thought it was way overhyped. Straight up thought I was just like eating salt. It was pretty. It was pretty. Eh. I'd say it, but mm. maybe it was the spice level I got. But I was not impressed at all. At all. Whoops. That was embarrassing. Not my little horn. Oh god. Oh shit. Not almost dropped that. And we still witness that on camera. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just a, just a little bit embarrassed. It's okay though. Café Tomo, Wagyu, Meat and Grill. Ooh, go yummy. Some really good boba. Ooh, is that an R3? Does he want to race? Do you want to be homies? Hey guys, <clears throat> so we just left uh, dinner in this case. We kind of got pokey, which I mean, I think you guys saw. I ended up trying the burrito for the first time. Uh, it was honestly really good. I mean, it's just a big sushi roll that you basically customize yourself. But the only thing about it, and I don't know if this is the case for all uh, pokey burritos, but right when I was opening up the packaging, it was already falling apart. And I swear I've seen that with like a few. So I don't know if that's normal or the place I go to just doesn't know how to wrap burritos. But uh, yeah, it doesn't kind of doesn't really hold together that well. So that's the only bummer. But I mean, besides that, it was fantastic. Nice little meal to end the night. Got some protein, and it was healthy. So can't really complain. Dun, 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 uh. Ooh, do, 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 yeah, and do, 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 just somebody to love. I don't know if you guys saw that, but that was a mouse. Almost ran that little fella over. That was super random. Alright guys. Well, thanks for watching, per usual. I appreciate any feedback down in the comments. I'm always looking. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.